Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is time for my favorite driver to make another appearance. That's right, today we are taking a look at Casey Kane's 2022 number 9 Fuel Me 164 scale sprint car. Now, before we get off to too quick of a start, we're going to zoom on out and take a look at the artwork here. So here you can see we got Casey Kane, number nine, Fuel Me, and then we got Caravan for the Caravan Trailers, uh, World of Outlaws logo, 2022, number nine, Fuel Me, uh, Casey, well, Casey Kane there, but Fuel Me sprint car. Uh, you go to the back side here. Oh, it doesn't actually say. Uh, he races for himself, Casey Kane Racing. Doesn't have the logo for the team back here, but it is that that is the case. Um, and you can see the artwork is pretty much just, it's all blue. The card is all blue with... The number nine in Fuel Me, which just so happens to be, actually it would be this side of the wing, just so happens to be this side of the wing. Caravan, just so happens to be here. It's literally just the artwork for the car up here. So, kind of weird. Um, and then, of course, they have his name. That's the way it's, uh, the logo or the way it's looked on his uh, race team as well. So, that's the art card. Now, let's go ahead and take a nice close look at the sprint car. Uh, last year's car was kind of an all-blue caravan trailers car. Here, you can see they've added a lot of black. You see, we've got Fuel Me up there on the top. We've got our number nine. We've got ASC on the front wing. Also, we've got Curb Records there on the front wing from the side. we got caravan trailers uh, along the uh, the engine cover. Uh, but around here, uh, that's where the caravan trailers was last year as well. They... They don't have the top wing anymore. That's where the Fuel Me sponsorship went. And then you see on the hood, we got Valvoline. But you see that nice yellow accent all around the hood. And it kind of stripes around the back. It really helps this car out. It's not so bland. It was blue and gray last year. And a nice yellow really... Um Really accents the paint scheme nicely. Here on the front, you can see caravan trailers up there. Just says caravan, but uh, then it's nothing but black up here. You know what that's good for on a 118th scale? A signature. But yeah, very open. A lot of room there. You can see we got the NOS Energy Drink uh, World of Outlaws logo over there. And then you go to this side, you can see same thing as the other side. We've got the black and the yellow. Um, the only thing I will say is the tail tank being black instead of blue this year. Uh, the two yellow stripes coming down the tail tank look actually really good. They pop nicely. Uh, and then you can see the blue kind of coming up from the bottom uh, over here on the right side. Uh, really, I, I like that blue. I would have preferred this car to have a little more blue than it does for the black. But, you know, it still looks really solid. Um... But overall, it's a pretty good-looking paint scheme. I do prefer this one to the Caravan Trailers one that was released last year. Um, but at the end of the day, would I take this one over Brad Sweets? Uh, I think I would. But I'm also very biased because I'm a huge Casey Kane fan. So you know what? You can't even say anything about it. Fight me. This is my channel. I'll say what I want. Uh, so anyway, guys, thank you all for watching the video. I hope you guys have enjoyed. This has been Race Craze, and we will see you in the next Diecast Review.